I just started having anxiety episodes when I was 18 years old, with symptoms like a panic attack when thinking about the future, and elevated her rat and trembling in my legs, mouth, and hands. Even though I thought that I was the only one going through this, the World Health Organization says differently. As a young girls and women, we have a higher probability of experience and anxiety disorders as a young boys and men. The organization mentioned that anxiety disorders and anxiety symptoms tend to begin in a childhood and adolescence. I am Shanice Palacios, Miss Nicaragua 2023. The agenda for the United Nations 2030 Sustainable Development plans create a strategic with 70 objectives for sustainable development. These objectives are an urgent call for immediate action to all countries worldwide. Of these 17 objectives, number three is about our health and well-being. I want to speak on mental health, especially an anxiety in a woman because the reality is it is affecting people all over the world. The past October 10th was the World Mental Health Day. The motto that World Health Organization meant was mental health is a universal right because no matter who we are or where we are, we all have the right to be healthy and mental health. It is the right to be able accessible, dignified, and quality health. Do not offer it, we violate human rights. It's necessary to adopt measures to resolve decades of neglect and insufficient development in mental health service as a result of the stigmas and discrimination. And I'm not the one say that. Dr. Tedros Ahenon, Director General of the World Health Organization does. Young girls and women must be our priority by offering them research and the necessary and qualified support they need. We will in turn see women with less anxiety, less depressing thought, and we will see more women rise as a leader and raise emotional health in their works and see women's governing. Andrea Campos is a woman whose vision I admire. With a deep history of anxiety and experience in program development, she found the mental health app, Jana, you are not alone. I, as a familiar leader and a creator of change, I have the responsibility and I am willing to become the voice for this initiative for more people benefit to this research that is readily available. I am sure that because of this research, many women will now have the best tools they can have at their disposal. I trust that together we can work on supporting this sustainable solution and in doing so, achieve a worry aid for our mental health.